Dream World is a family theme park located on the Gold Coast and with it having over 40 rides and attractions, it is easy to see why it's one of the top tourist attractions in Australia. However, today we're going to count down the top 10 rides at Dream World. Starting off at number 10, we have Shockwave. And no matter whether you are looking to get even dizzier than you already have before, or just want another fun family attraction, then this San Perla Disco is just for you. Similar to such attractions as Giant Red Back at Aussie World, as soon as you have boarded one of the 24 seats on the disc, you will begin to rise up and down on the W-shaped track. But here is where it gets cool, as your car also spins at up to 12 revolutions per minute and you do not need to be a rocket scientist to know that is intense but also very fun. It is time for our first roller coaster on the list as taking our number 9 spot we have Escape from Madagascar where you with help of course from Skipper, Kowalski, Rico and Pilot from the Madagascar films will need to try your best to escape the country. However, it is not all easy flying, because along your way not only will you experience many drops, twists and turns, but this is also an invert, meaning that for the entire duration of the ride, your legs will be fully dangling. How cool, but also rather scary is that. The question is though, do you have what it takes to escape Madagascar? Comment down below. Have you ever wanted to fly across the stunning Australia? Well, if so, you must take a trip on our number 8 spot, Sky Voyager, as you can do just that. However, before we do begin to talk about the ride itself, with it being situated at the entrance to the park, if you do want to maximise your day due to it having such a large input, we would recommend trying for more unique rides first and then going in here at the middle of the day. Nevertheless, this flying theatre is 100% worth a ride, as through the use of state-of-the-art technology, you will really feel like you are flying across the 12 regions of Australia within a 5-minute ride, creating an experience which you honestly will never forget. For our number 7 spot on our top 10 list, Things are about to go a lot faster as we have Mike Donahan's motorbike roller coaster. And similar to your motorbike coasters, this ride definitely does pack a punch. Based on the famous motorbike racer Mike Donahan, on this coaster you can follow his footsteps by jumping aboard your very own 500cc racing bike and then that will race around many high speed corners as well as rising up and down at over 72 kilometers an hour. Yes, you heard me right, 72 kilometers an hour. So what are you waiting for? Get on your motorbike or for the smaller racers and disabled guests sidecar for a race like no other. Get your sick bags ready as coming in at number six, we have Pandemonium, where the phrase Intense has been taken to the next level. Nevertheless, if you do dare to ride, you'll definitely be in for a treat, with in a nutshell your carriage spinning around in circles whilst also rotating upside down over and over and over again for the entire two minute duration of the ride. Therefore, with all of this awesome kung fu theming too, there is absolutely no doubt in my mind that this is perfect for both thrill seekers in the group, but also a definite must do ride at the park. Top 5 woo, woo, And for this position, you'll be able to get the opportunity to board as well as fly your very own stunt plane on Tailspin. Now, with this ride being identical to many all around the world, we would normally suggest trying the more unique attractions first. But with it being so, so much fun, we had to put it at our number 5 spot. 
once boarded the plane know you will notice two handles next to you but we will get onto that later on as first of all you will rise and rotate diagonally through the air however here is where the handles come in handy as if you want to move them in the right way you can spin yourself fully upside down how cool is that you can't have a theme park without a good old classic coaster and dream world is no exception as taking our number four spot we have gold coaster previously known as hot wheels the ride since its opening back in 2001 this has always been a fan favorite and for good reason as with it featuring everything from big drops to loops to even some bank twists and turns this ride is totally amazing yet for me what makes this ride so great is the onboard audio as no matter whether you are riding for your first fifth or hundredth time nothing beats jamming to those tunes whilst heading around the intense layout we have made it to the top three rides at the park and for this position we have the claw which trust me when i say is as scary as it sounds similar to many of your other gyro swings from all around the world if you are brave enough to ride you will board a circular disc which will then not only rise up and down but also spin around However, unlike your normal gyro swing, you will raise 8 storeys high, soar through the air at 64 km an hour and almost go upside down. So, yeah, this ride is plain down intense and with the addition of the raw some dragon theming, a trip to the park is nowhere near complete without a ride. If you are scared of heights, then skip to number one, as taking our number two spot, we have the giant drop. And as the name may so subtly suggest, this is not for the faint of heart. Standing at a total of 119 meters tall, already I know some of you are like, no way Jose, but it does not stop there, as this is the tallest free falling ride in Australia, meaning that as soon as you make it to the top and enjoy those spectacular views of the park, you will then plummet back down to the bottom causing even the biggest thrill seekers in the group to let out a little scream. We have made it to the number one spot and for the best ride at the park we have no other than the new for 2021 Steel Typen. And if I was going to talk about every great part on this Mac multi-launch, we would literally be here all day. But here are a few of my top picks. Now for starters, the layout is incredible, with it featuring everything from both forward and backward launches, to crazy bank turns, to inversions, to air times, to everything imaginable. This ride is great, although we are still not at the best part yet as if you want your experience to be, let's just say, 10 times better, then for only an extra 25 Australian dollars you can have the tail whip experience, which in a nutshell is a backward spinning car, and I don't need to tell you how awesome that would be. Therefore, for all of this and so, so much more, including the theming, it is quite easy to see why this is the number one ride on our top 10 rides at Dreamworld list. Thank you all for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.